We've got Mizzou this week, midweek. Um, looks like rain's going to be a factor this week. Um, not sure if we'll get that one in or not. Uh, but this weekend against Bradley at home looks like we're going to have a good weekend again. Uh, get some rain here early in the week and throughout the week. And then uh, Friday uh, should clear up and get some wind going again and dry us out and be ready to go for a sunny Saturday. Missouri's really good. I uh, think not sure on what their ranking is, uh, but they just, um, they just took two out of three from Georgia, uh, who I think was ninth in the country. Uh, just took two out of three from them. Pitching staff is really good. Um, offensively, they've got five kids that are hitting 325 or better. Um, you know, we know what we're going to get from Mizzou. Uh, we have to play a really good game, be, uh, be able to manufacture a couple runs, and uh, be able to keep them off balance at the plate. Uh, you know, they're a beatable team. We've been in games with them in the last five years where we've had opportunities. Uh, and we just haven't been able to cash in there as well. So I uh, always look forward to playing them because it's a kind of a measuring stick to see where you're at at this point in the year uh, and just hopefully see our kids elevate to that level. Bradley, um, offensively, they've got great numbers. Uh, you know, they've got a couple of kids in the top, in the league leaders for hitters. Um, they've got potential to hit home runs, which they did this weekend. Um, to, to, uh, to help them win some games this weekend. Um, you know, I think pitching is their inconsistent aspect of their team right now. And uh, you know, where they're losing games, they're losing it in the circle. Um, but you know, in the last four years, Bradley's been a really tough team for us, whether they're uh, at the top of the league or at the bottom of the league. They've been uh, you know, one of those thorns on our side. So we got to be ready to play. Uh, and it's, you know, it's, once again, it's nice to be at home. Hopefully we can keep that, uh, that home feeling going.